So when you are a student at Drake University, you will of course eventually choose a major. You'll probably have minors and concentrations. All of those credits go through your department and you achieve that major and you graduate. But on the way to doing that, you also take courses in the Drake curriculum. At Drake, we call those courses Areas of Inquiry courses and we shorten that to AOIs. We have 10 AOIs that we want you to take while you are taking your classes at Drake and this could take you all four years. You get to pick and choose and you can time those courses out in a way that best fits your schedule. Our AOIs are really kind of split between two different kinds of classes, subject matter classes and skill classes or competency classes. So we require that you leave Drake with a true liberal arts education where you've mastered or gained competency in scientific literacy, quantitative literacy, historical foundations, written communication, and artistic expression. Those five AOIs are more the subject matter ones. You might take a history class, passages to 1850. You might take um, physics with a lab. You might take mm, drawing, right? Like let's say you've always wanted to draw. You learn how to draw, you get your artistic experience AOI. Those five kinds of AOIs happen at any time in your college career alongside your major while you're also taking the five kinds of AOIs that are more skill or competency based. These are truly distinctive in the Drake curriculum. Many, many schools when you're talking about their gen ed requirements are gonna say, yeah, you have to write and you have to do math and you have to have science. We're doing those, but we're doing those in unique ways in and outside of the major. We're also saying, a Drake graduate is going to have area of inquiry competence in values and ethics, in information literacy, in critical thinking. We're going to say that you have taken a class where you learn to be an engaged citizen, and you're going to have done a class that gives you global and cultural competencies and understandings. Those are often not within a particular discipline. So you might take a global competency class that's a history course. Your values and ethics class might be in the College of Business. Your class around critical thinking might very well be something taught in our School of Education. You get to explore while progressing towards your major while doing the Drake curriculum. We also require that all students who attend Drake leave having had a class that helps them deeply understand diversity in the United States. That's not an area of inquiry. It is a requirement and you get it by taking classes in your major or by taking one of the AOIs that's also certified as a diversity course. A lot of times students will ask me, well, I'm coming in with AP Psychology, or I have an IB curriculum, or I have CLEP credits. Often those classes will count, or those credits that you're bringing in will count towards your AOIs, especially in the AOIs that are scientific reasoning or quantitative literacy. So you know that you will get some of those covered if you're bringing those credits in, while at the same time you get to take engaged citizen classes and values and ethics. I also often have students ask me, are these giant classes? You know, like if I'm going to a large school doing gen ed, am I gonna be in a lecture hall with 200 students? Absolutely not. The majority of our classes at Drake are small classes, by which I mean under 35 students. And the majority of our AOIs are actually discussion-based, interactive, highly participatory courses, not big lecture halls. Sure, you might take psychology, you know, intro to psychology, and it might be a much larger class than your high school psychology class, but you'll also have lab sections because those are required for the AOI that get you into a smaller setting and you will absolutely know the professor who teaches that class. None of our classes are taught by teaching assistants, even at those levels of the courses that are gen eds in other universities. Students also ask, do I have to take all of the AOIs my first two years before I can get to the major? Nope. You can take your AOIs over the four years and you can jump right into your major courses from day one. Often those major courses are going to count towards your values and ethics. I'm, I'm sorry, often those courses are going to count towards your area of inquiry. So let's say you're a political science international relations major and in your first semester, you're taking politics one, American politics, and politics 75, international relations. One counts for multiculturalism and diversity. 75 counts for uh, global and multicultural. So you're taking a class for your major that also counts for your area of inquiry. When students do that, they're able to double major really easily. They're able to take advantage of other parts of the Drake curriculum that make us really unique and distinctive. 
they're able to study abroad because you're double counting in a way that that actually reinforces the learning that you're doing. You're learning in the major, you're learning in the liberal arts, all of it heading in the same direction.